Hi everybody, Sanbona and welcome to my channel. Kamala Munda and I'm Ledger. And on this channel, Kulumama Reality TV shows on my celebrities and my YouTubers. If it's your first time joining me today and you really like my content, do not forget to press the subscribe button. Long as that. So, you guys remember, Ugozi Unonku on the show Real Housewives of Devon season four, she had spoken about what happened with her and RD, her ex boyfriend. Uh, that she thought RT used Muti on her. RT had stolen her building material to the value of 300,000 rands, and that there was, uh, it was, it had become a legal issue. So RT got upset about that, contacted some lawyers, and they issued Unonku uh, with a cease and desist, which means that you must stop talking about a certain subject. And also they demanded that Unoku must apologize. They said that they, they, they demanded that she makes a public apology. I knew Ugutu Unoku was just going to blue tick this guy. Because, I mean, I was like, I mean, really now, Arti. <laughs> Do you think Unoku is going to apologize? So they're saying they gave her, you know, uh, a certain amount of time. I don't know if they were supposed to be over 24 hours or 48 hours for her to issue an apology. And Nongku was like, okay, maybe in the next lifetime. <laughs> and she didn't do it, you guys. So in this article here, they're talking about that. Listen, I thought Arti was just pushing it. It was just never going to happen. Nongku is not going to apologize to that guy. So Nongku Williams fails to apologize to X amid legal action threats. Anyway, you guys, the, the letter from the lawyers was posted on Arti's Instagram. And I was looking at that letter, I was like, mm, it does look legit, you know, but Lama lawyers love Vele. Okay. Lama lawyers Vele are representative of Nabo Artigans. Okay. And a defined Nongo Williams has not apologized for her to her former lover, Tumsani Lanzi, known as Ralph Diamond, after he threatened to sue her for defamation. The Real Housewives of Durban Star had until Sunday the 3rd. Uh, to apologize to a, her ex a, or face legal action, okay? And Nongko was like, I will take my chances in court. <laughs> then apologize to you, okay? In a letter by uh, Lanzi's lawyer, Sabelo Kubisa and Kubisa attorneys, he demanded that she write an apology address to him and share it on all social media platforms where defamatory uh, material was shared okay i don't know okay he, he, she will have to call show max and say go to show max okay let's shoot an episode where i apologize to rd okay <laughs> should you face should you fail to uh, publicly apologize to a client as outlined we shall have no alternative but to take legal action against you for damage on the ground of defamation the letter of demand stated Nongu also accused Lanz of stealing her construction material. Listen, you guys, a guy that uh, that is being accused of stealing building material, I don't know if he can afford to pay lawyers to sue somebody, okay? But I don't know, you guys, okay? Uh, so it says here, the letter said, our client will be forced to protect and clear his good name and reputation by taking all necessary legal steps, okay? We hereby demand that you immediately retract and remove all social media posts or pages on social media platforms containing any false or defamatory information or misrepresentation such as those explained in the letter. Listen, you guys, obviously these lawyers don't really, uh, didn't even know what they were talking about because guys, it wasn't a social there was no social media post about the issue the whole thing was on real housewives on show mix okay so i'm like I, that's why i was saying go see these lawyers uh, touch because i was like even the lawyers didn't do their homework okay what post was Unonko supposed to remove because she did not say it's on social media she said it on the show okay even i can represent Lanzi Pera, okay? You made such allegations knowing very well that they are untruthful and unlawful, but continue to public uh, to publish it with the sole intention of causing damage to our client's reputation and dignity. It is our instruction that these allegations leveled against our client 
were made in an effort to damage his good name of a client in both his personal and professional capacity. Listen, you guys, I don't think that Nonko's uh, intentions were to damage uh, Arti's good name. That is, if he has a good name, I think her intention was just for her to not look like she was stupid last season, you know? <laughs> That's all. She was just concerned with herself, okay? Kubisa confirmed to Zimoja that the businesswoman had not apologized to his client as per their demand because you guys were demanding something that was impossible to do. I mean, go back and do your homework. You are saying Nonku must remove the social media post. Which post, guys? Listen, if you know of any post where Nonku was talking about this issue, please let me know. But my understanding is that the whole thing took place on Showmax, okay? The show on Showmax. Maybe you can ask them to do a diary session for Nonku where she apologizes to you, okay? These lawyers here. <laughs> and they've already taken the money for writing this letter that is uh, full of untruths itself, okay? <laughs> the letter that is claiming that Nonku is telling untruths has untruths in itself, okay? I don't know, guys. The former couple had been in a romantic relationship that ended last year. You know, it was a short relationship, but it, 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 a lot happened in that relationship that all of us felt like we were in it for five years, okay? So far, a defiant Nongu has not removed the defamatory post. Guys, where are the posts? Maybe I need to go and look for the post, okay? And according to a source close to her, all she wants from Glanzi is for him to pay her money. She won't apologize because she owes he owes her money. Glanzi has since moved on. And she, you can't move on while you owe me money. <laughs> We shall not move on until you pay me my money, okay? And shared pictures of himself with his new partner on social media. While Nonku said she was ready to find love again, Nonku could not be reached for comment, okay? Listen, you guys. I don't know. This thing doesn't make sense, okay? Nonku spoke on show, makes show, but she's being asked to remove posts, okay? Just to be safe, maybe I'll go and just check Nonko's uh, social media because I don't remember Nonko posting anything about this issue, okay? But maybe she did. But I'm just saying that, you know, the lawyer should have done their homework that the whole thing was said on a show, make sure. Anyway, you guys, tell me what you think about this in the comments. Do you think that Nonko even considered apologizing to RD? Do you think? Do you think that she will be doing it in the future? Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. Like it before Puma Gona share it with your friends, with your family, and even with strangers.